That's a great question about GA or granuloma annulare and about lifestyle or dietary modifications. You know, unfortunately, there is really little to no evidence that changing diet or lifestyle has anything to do with granuloma annulare. We wish as board certified dermatologists that we can say, hey, go gluten free or just don't eat meat and your GA will melt away. There is absolutely no evidence that that is true. So we don't make those recommendations. However, we do know that granuloma annulare is this autoimmune attack against collagen in your dermis. So dermis is the second or deeper layer of skin. So that's why ointments and creams, including steroids, don't really work to stop that autoimmune attack. Those ointments can only dissolve maybe into the epidermis. They don't get into the dermis. So very commonly, a dermatologist will do little intralesional shots of cortisone into that granuloma annulare plaque. If you start getting rings of GA everywhere, well, some can be sun exposed. So if you're getting them on your chest or your upper arms, the sun is inducing more GA. But we know that granuloma annulare can be induced by tick bites, bug bites. It can be induced by a bad sunburn, actually, if you have diabetes. But the vast majority of cases of GA just happen. It's what's called idiopathic. So besides shots, if it gets everywhere, we try medications like hydroxychloroquine. If it gets really bad, we start putting people on methotrexate and certain biologics like ustekinumab. But in general, it's a harmless condition. Sometimes it burns out on its own, but lifestyle and dietary modifications unfortunately don't help.